Hello everyone, how are you guys doing today? Today we're talking about how to make your scripts in your scripting editor make different colors and make it look nice. Uh, this is going to be my first time using it and uh, I actually haven't done this before because I personally like Roblox, but uh, I might actually touch up some stuff and fix it how I like. Um, so honestly, this is just your preference, do however you want. I'm just going to show you how to do it, show you a way to just know what you're doing and everything and figure it out. Um, please subscribe. We got like 4.2% of you guys that are subscribed, I guess. It's crazy, but thank you guys so much, though, for 1,150 subscribers. That's amazing. And also, please join the Discord. We are doing the giveaway just to be here. But um, it's going to be nice. It's amazing. And I hope we can see you guys there. So, uh, yeah, let's get into this. So, what you're going to be doing is actually going inside a uh, uh, script. Might as well just go inside a script. Oh, shit. Go inside a script. And how you're going to be doing this is going to file. Um, sorry, I need to, might need to turn off my webcam right here. Actually, no, let's see here. So we go to file, advance, no, file, and then you go to studio settings, okay? File, studio settings, so it was over here. Um, once you do that, you are going to pop up and you're going to be put to this part right here. You're going to scroll down until you see script editor color presets. Now, this is where it talks about everything, like literally everything. Um, I personally don't know which I want to do and what I want to do. But I am going to do some stuff where I think I might do for comments and uh, some stuff to look at. So I might, yeah, this is, might be a little bit of a long video. I'll see what I'm doing. So let's just, like, test this out. I think I can just do it right here if I'm right and then hit close. Some settings will not take until you reset. Okay, so even if I... Okay, so it did work. Okay, so that's my comments. I do not like that. <laughs> um, so we're going to go to advanced. I mean, studio settings again. We're going to change that back. I think I'm going to go with like a white or a gray like normal. That was, I like the gray. Um, there is green, I heard. That's a pretty good color. Uh, but I wouldn't recommend that. So probably like a, that'd be a cool color. Um, string color, that's okay. Number color, I like the, well, yeah, I like that. I wanted to go with like a bluish type theme. Um, text color, people do change that. I don't want to change that. Selection background, we'll keep that. Operator color, number co color, keyword color. I could name this to like a blue. Warning color, that's okay. Find selection background, built in function, white space, debug editor. So we got these. I don't really change anything. String color, I'm trying to think what it was. Wait a minute, I don't want to mention colors. Comment, no, okay. Let's just see. So if I do, okay, so that's my, I think I might stick with like a white. You guys think I should do a white? This is like the text color. Um, I There's a lot of themes actually, if you guys want to search up on dev forms right here where it talks about certain themes and uh, stuff like that. Why the hell did that happen? I hate when that happens. Okay, so, um, Let's just, yeah, so local function. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, do stuff. I'm just looking at this guy's code right here just because why not? And see how it works. Uh, doing stuff, okay? And then if one, one equals two, then blah, blah, blah. Let's see the print statement. That's okay. And then matching text, also matching text. Okay, so that's okay. That looks okay. Um, I actually don't know what color I want. So this is all I really wanted to bring this to you guys. Is all you got to do is uh change this kind of stuff, and it's it's super easy to be honest. That's just what you got to do, and you'll figure it out. Um, I really don't know what kind of colors I like. Maybe I'll have to go in. Let's just go into one of these things. Oh, Death UI. New scripts, right? Service. Let's do this. Oh, maybe that is kind of cool. I'll do like that. Okay, yeah. So I got blue now. That's pretty sick. So that's my that's my color now. I got blue is my color because, you know, I like that kind of stuff. And then the comet color. You know what I'm going to... Shit. <laughs> I'm going to do is comet color because I personally like a bright color because this helped me go with things. We're going to go with white. So we're going to grab this. Maybe I could go with like a light blue. No, no, no. Or a light green. That's weird. We're going to go with white. 
Let's just try white. Okay. Let's see how this looks right now. No, it's too. What's a good color that's just different from others? Maybe I'll do like pink. Sorry, guys. I don't really know what I'm doing with the colors. So I don't want this to be a long video, so I'm going to end this right here. Uh, that's pretty much all you guys got to do, to be honest, like I said. Uh, just figure out the colors you want, you know, and figure out uh, what you think is best for you, what, what you think matches what you'd like to do. Oh, that'd be kind of cool. It's, that's cool. We're going to keep it like that. Perfect. So now I got a pink. This is like a custom one. You can change this all you guys want, and you'll understand these later how there's like certain key terms, why there's certain colors and everything. I'm kind of just keeping everything the same because I like I like the green and everything. It's broad, and it helps me understand things. So yeah, so that's all I got for you guys today. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.